Hi, um, this is my shelf tour video. Um, I currently have over 1500 volumes on my shelves. So what I've decided to do is all I'm going to talk about is the volumes themselves. Nothing about the series, just the volumes that I have and any sort of stories maybe about how I got the volumes. I have 270 plus series as well. If I were to talk about every series it would be hours long. So what I want to do is split out talking about series into some other videos at a later point and we're just going to talk about the volumes. For anyone interested, my shelves are standard IKEA Billy bookcases. Um, I've gone for the dark brown black colour and I bought extra shelves so instead of a standard six I have nine plus an extension on top, well with an extension on top so extension on top plus eight so nine shelves on each set and I have five full width and one half width behind me you can see. So the lighting isn't particularly good in this room which is why I originally strung fairy lights along so I could at least see the spines because I think the spines look really pretty. I hope the lighting is going to be okay for the video, I apologise in advance if you see some shadows of me and my camera or any shakiness. Um, it's quite high up the top shelf so I'm holding the camera above my head to be able to <laughs> get the volumes. I like to keep a lot of things on my shelves. I have my Amiibo, my Nendroids, and my Funko Pops. I'm going to be clearing all of these away because I don't want to have to just continuously be moving them around because you're going to... It's too much unnecessary noise and faff, so they're all going to be shifted along for when I do the video. Hope you enjoy. So, as I said, this is going to be entirely talking about what is on my shelves, not the series themselves. I'm going to do that in some later videos I think because I just have too many. This video is going to be long enough as is without me talking about every series. Um, apologise for any shakiness. I'm quite high up. I'm holding the camera above my head. <laughs> not, it's not particularly stable but let's, let's see how it goes. So first we have Absolute Duo Volume 1. Accomplishments of the Duke's Daughter Volumes 1 to 3. Stage, volume 1. I understand why the series has been discontinued. I have a weird peeve of I don't like volume 1's touching on my shelves. I, my volume of Actage volume 2 was cancelled and I've not seen it in any stores in the UK so I assume it's never made its way over. <laughs> but oh well. Um, After Hours volumes 1 and 2. The Alchemist Who Survives Now Dreams of a Quiet City Life, Volume 1. All You Need Is Kill, and um, this is the Omnibus, so it's got both Volumes 1 and 2 in it. An Incurable Case of Love, Volumes 1 to 5. Ancient Major's Bride, Volumes 1 to 5. Anonymous Noise, Volumes 1 to 3. Alharu Ride, Volumes 1 to 13, and this is complete. <laughs> Arachnid, Volume 1. I actually need to take this off my shelf because I accidentally bought it in French and I can't read French. Um, and it was never published in English, so it turns out, so I just need to take that off. Arifretta from Commonplace to World's Strongest, Volume 1. That stupid tiny volume there, it's Ascendance of the Bookworm, Part 1, Volume 1. And then we have 1 to 8 of Assassination Classroom. Right, so next row down we have the rest of Assassination Classroom. So I do have 1 to 21, so that's complete. Then we have Astrid, Lost in Space, Volumes 1 to 5, and that's complete. Then we have Attack on Titan. Um, 1 to 25. So on this next row we've got volumes 26 to 31 of Attack on Titan. So that's now up to, uh, that's up to date with what's out in the UK I think. Attack on Titan Before the Fall, volumes 1 to 7. Attack on Titan Junior High, volumes 1. Attack on Titan No Regrets, volumes 1 and 2. Azumanga Daya, volume 1. Backy Man, Volumes 1 through 20. 
Beastars Volumes 1 to 4. And tidying in the corner is Berserk Volume 1 Dark Horse Edition. Next row. I'm able to get off my stool now. <laughs> so we have Volume 1 of Beyond the Clouds, Volume 1 through 18 of Blackbird, Volumes 1 and 2 of Black Butler, and Volumes 1 to 23 of Black Clover. And that's to date with what's out in the UK. So we have Poor Little Black Torch Volume 1 hiding in the corner. I should complete that so it's just not in shadow anymore. Then we have Black Canvas, my so-called Artist Journey Volume 1. And then we have a whole bunch of bleach. Um, I don't have all of it, I only have 1 to 334 and Volume 61 and 62 because I got those on sale. I also have Blue Exorcist Volumes 1 to 3 and Blue Flag Volumes 1, 2 and 3. So on this shelf we have Volume 4 of Blue Flag, which again I think is up to date with what's out in the UK. Volumes 1 to 9 of Baruto, again up to date. Breasts are my most favourite thing in the world. Volume 1. <laughs> card catch Sakura Clear Card. I do have the like new reprints of Card Catcher's Sakura itself. They're just not on the shelf because they don't fit. <laughs> They're on a special shelf with the other silly sized volumes. Uh, Case Study of Venitas, volumes 1 and 2. Cells at Work, Volumes 1 and 2. Cells at Work, Code Black, Volume 1. Certain Magical Index, Volumes 1 to 4. Chainsaw Man, Volumes 1. Children of the Whales, Volumes 1 to 7. Chobits, Volumes 1 to 8, and that's complete. Um, Chobits, Volume 2, is probably one of my oldest manga in my collection. I bought it second hand about 10 years ago and then it sat on my shelves all on its own till quite recently where I bought the rest second hand. Um, and then Citrus Volumes 1 to 10 and that's complete. So on this shelf we have Claymore Volumes 1 and 2, Cromarty High School Volumes 1 to 4. This is another out of print series that I've been trying to collect but it's starting to get a bit expensive. Um, I also don't think they printed everything into English, which makes it a bigger bummer, but I've been quite enjoying it. I think I'm going to still try and collect what I can for now. Uh, then we have Daytime Shooting Star, Volumes 1 to 8. Dead Man Wonderland, Volumes 1 to 13. Uh, this is complete. I do quite like the whole black and white alternate volume look. I think I have a few others in my collection. Um, death, I call <laughs> I call this Death March Rhapsody. I know there are other words in the title, but they're so tiny. I do think the whole title is Death March to the Parallel World Rhapsody, but they're tiny. <laughs> it's Death March Rhapsody to me. Um, and then Flames 1 to 13 of Death Note. Uh, so here we have Delicious Dungeon, Flames 1 to 8. Uh, I think it is actually called Delicious in Dungeon, but it's another series with a tiny word that I can't properly read. Delicious Dungeon is, for now, to me. Oh well. <laughs> um, Demon Prince and Mochi House, Volumes 1 to 9. I know that's finished recently. Um, I do want to try and wrap that up because I quite enjoyed that. But yeah, I should do that. Uh, Demon Slayer, Volumes 1 to 18. They're printing these really quickly at the moment. I think I have both 19 and 20 on pre order, and I think they come out by the end of January, um, which is crazy, but I'm, wait, why am I complaining? I'm not complaining. I'm not. Um, volumes 1 and 2 of Destiny Lovers, Volume 1 of The Devil is a Part-Timer, Defrag, Volumes 1 and 2, Didn't I Say to Make My Abilities Average in the Next Life, Volumes 1 to 3, Dirty Pear, which I think is an omnibus, Die Volume 1 and Dora Hedora Volume 1. So we're on the bottom row of the first shelf now. It's quite low down, so it's a bit dark as well compared to some of the others. Um, so first series is Do You Love Your Mom and uh, Two Hit Multi Target Attacks. Um, volume 1 and 2. And we have Dr. Stone Volumes 1 to 14. 
Dragon Goes House Hunting Volumes 1 and 2. Then Dragon Ball Volumes 1 to 7 and Dragon Ball Z Volumes 1 and 2. I really want to finish reading up Dragon Ball before I read Dragon Ball Z. Um, I've just been really slowly accumulating Dragon Ball, mostly buying second hand. So I need to get on that really, because I also want to read Super. <laughs> And we have Dragon Quest Monsters Plus Volumes 1 and 2, Dragon's Rioting Volume 1, Dreaming Sun Volumes 1 to 5, Dungeon Builder The Demon King's Labyrinth is a, la a Modern City Volume 1, and The Dungeon of Black Company Volume 1. So this is the top shelf of my half width bookcase. Um, this <laughs> bookcase shouldn't take as long because primarily made up of three series. Um, so first we have Eden Zero volumes 1 to 7, Era Manga Sensei volumes 1 to 3. I assume they're going to be publishing more of that at some point but it doesn't feel that way at the moment. Um, Everyone's Getting Married volumes 1 and 2 and then 1 to 7 a fairy tale though if we make our way down we also have the rest of fairy tale which primarily makes up this bookcase so on this shelf we have the up to 63 and volumes 1 to 4 of 100 year quest which is the sequel so here we have volumes 5 and 6 of 100 year quest which i think is fairly up to date seven might be coming out soon though um volumes 1 to 4 of fairy tale bloom minstrel which is a spin-off featuring Wendy. Volumes 1 to 4 of Fairy Girls, which is also complete. Fairy Tale Ice Trail, Volumes 1 and 2, which is complete. Three spin-offs. Uh, Twin Dragons of Sabretooth, Rodonite and Lightning Gods, which I think is complete. Uh, I'm unsure on that one. And Fairy Tale S 1 and 2. Fairy Tale Zero, which is a one shot. Um, and that completes all of my fairy tale manga, which is a lot. So many spin offs. Um, then there's also Farming Life in Another World, Volume 1, and Fiance of the Wizard, Volume 1. Here we have Final Fantasy Lost Stranger, Volumes 1 to 5. Final Fantasy Type Zero, it's a one shot. Fire Force, Volumes 1 to 3. Fire in his fingertips, a fiery fireman ravishes me with his smouldering gaze, volumes 1 and 2. Fire Punch, volumes 1 to 3. Fly Me to the Moon, volumes 1 and 2. And Food Wars, volumes 1 to 3. So on this shelf we have more Food Wars, 4 to 24. And then just on the next shelf we actually finish Food Wars with the final volume, 36. Um, I also have the first two volumes of Fruit Basket when they were published by Tokyo Pop and the first collector's edition. I decided to start collecting the collector's edition instead for a few reasons. I think they look nicer and they're rainbow and I absolutely love rainbow spines and I've started to have real trouble with the Tokyo Pop Fruits Basket and I already have enough series that I'm struggling to collect whereas the Yen Press releases are more readily available at the moment so I'm probably going to get rid of the original Fruits Basket at some point. Uh, not sure when yet but um, yeah, I'm collecting the collector's one now. Also volumes 1 to 3 of Full Metal Alchemist. And then on the very bottom shelf, I have volumes 4 to 25 of Full Metal Alchemist. So, new shelf, and we start with the first last two volumes of Full Metal Alchemist, so that's complete. Um, volume 1 of Fushugi Yugi Genbu Kaiden. Uh, Gabriel Dropout, volume 1. Ghosts in the Shell, Standalone Complex, Volumes 1 to 5. Hintama, Volumes 1 to 3. Go with the Clouds, North by Northwest, Volume 1. Goblin Slayer, Volumes 1 and 2. Goblin Slayer, Brand New Day, Volume 1. 
Golden Camier, Volumes 1 to 6. Grand Blue Dreaming, Volumes 1 to 11. And Great Teacher Onizuka, Volumes 1 to 9. So we have some more Great Teacher Onizuka on the shelf. Um, I'm missing, I think, six volumes. 17, 19, 21, 22, 23, and 25. Yeah. Um, I've been trying to piecemeal it together. It's quite hard to find series, and I absolutely don't want to pay some of the incredibly insane prices that some people are asking for them. So these are very slowly being pieced together series. One day I hope to complete it. Um, then we have Haiku Volumes 1 and 2. Haven't you heard? I'm Sakamoto Volumes 1, 3 and 4. Volume 2 is just so hard to find for a reasonable price. I don't know why. Again, one day. I don't even think it's out of print, but oh well. Um, Hell's Paradise Volume 1. Helsing Volume 1. The Hero is Overpowered and Overly Cautious, Volumes 1 and 2. High School Prodigies Have It Easy Even in Another World, Volumes 1 and 2. Honey So Sweet, Volumes 1 to 8, that's complete. How Heavy Are the Dumbbells You Lift, Volumes 1, 2 and 3. How Not to Summon a Demon Lord, Volumes 1 to 3. And How to Build a Dungeon, Book of the Demon King, Volumes 1 to 6. On this shelf we have How to Raise a Boring Girlfriend, Volumes 1 and 6. I got Volume 6 because it was half off and I like buying things when they're on sale. Um, Hunter x Hunter, Volumes 1 to 4. Hybrid Heart, Volume 1. I might my best friend to shut my parents up, vol well, Volume 1. I think it's a one shot, so complete. I want to eat your pancreas, and that is the omnibus. The Ideal Sponge of Life, Volumes 1 and 2. If it's for my daughter, I'd even defeat the Demon Lord, Volumes 1 and 2. Inspector, Volume 1. Interspecies Reviewers, Volumes 1 to 4. Interviews with Monster Girls, Volume 1. Is it wrong to pick up girls in a dungeon, Volumes 1 to 10? I think that's been discontinued. It's been a very long time since it's been a new volume. There's a lot of spin offs that I'd like to try and pick up, but. I was hoping to do the main series first, but that might not happen now. I've been killing slimes for 300 years and maxed up my level volumes 1 to 3. Um, I've got the first um, complete part 1 of Jojo and first 3 of part 2 on this shelf. So we have the last volume of part 2 of Jojo on this shelf. Um, volumes 1 to 4 of Jujutsu Kaisen, and, and behind a couple of volumes, I need to get those. Volumes 1 to 4 of Juni Taisen Zodiac War, and um, that's complete. Kaguya Sama, Love is War, volumes 1 to 17. Uh, Kakiguri, volumes 1 to 12, and Kakiguri Twin, volume 1. Uh, so we have volumes 1 to 6 of Kakurio. Um I think this is printing yearly now which is so long. So I think volume 6 came out not too long ago and it's been a year since I got volume 5. Um, volumes 1 and 2 of Kamisama Kiss. Volumes 1 to 12 of Kiss Him Not Me. I'm only missing two more and then I've completed that. Komi Can't Communicate volumes 1 to 9, my favourite series. <laughs> Konosuba volumes 1 to 10. Kanasuba, an explosion on this wonderful world, volumes 1 to 5. Kuma 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 Bear, volumes 1 and 2. Laid Back Camp, volumes 1 to 3. And Land of the Lustrous, volume 1. Uh, now we have my Zelda manga. Um, some of the first manga I actually got, I think. I have part 1 and part 2 of Ocarina of Time. Then the Oracle pair. And... The Four Sword Adventures. I have two copies of Majora's Mask, somehow. I'm not actually sure how. Um, Minish Cap, Phantom Hourglass, Link to the Past, and then volumes one to seven of Twilight Princess. Which again, I think it's been printed yearly at the moment. <laughs> um, Little Witch Academia, volumes one to three. Living Room Matsuga-san, volumes one to five. 
Log Horizon 1 to 4 and 9. Again, 9 was on sale and yeah, I can't resist a sale. Uh, Love Hina, volumes 1 to 14. Uh, this is the Tokyo Pop um, print. Uh, 1 to 3 was, uh, was some of the first volumes I was ever given, so I wanted to try and collect the rest in that edition. Some of them are a bit questionable in terms of quality. For example, volume 7 is quite torn at the bottom. Um, I think actually there was a volume I bought once and when it arrived it had big chunks of it cut out. Um, anyone who knows Love Hina knows that there are some questionable scenes and it was all of those scenes that got cut out and it felt very gross. So I immediately contacted who I bought it from and got another one. I didn't want the old one back though, so it just sort of hung around for a while. I don't remember what I did with it though. Never mind. Um, and Love in Hell, the complete trilogy. Omnibus. So we have Love Me, Love Me Not, Volumes 1 to 3. Lost Gears, Volume 1. Mage and Abyss, Volumes 1 to 5. Uh, Magi, Magi, um, whatever you wish to call it, Volumes 1 to 23. Made some uh, um, omnibus one, and two, and three and four. A man and his cat, volume one, and Midnight Secretary, volumes one to four. So we have the Misfit of Demon King Academy, volumes one and two. Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid, volumes one and two. Miss Koizumi loves ramen noodles, volumes one and two. Mobile Suit Gundam: The Origin, volume one. Monster Hunter Flash Hunter Volumes 1 to 3. Moriarty the Patriot Volume 1. Mushoku Tensei Volumes 1 to 3. My Hero Academia Volumes 1 to 25. And My Hero Academia Vigilantes Volumes 1 to 6. So we have Volumes 1 and 2 of My Love Story. My Next Path as a Villainous, All Roots Lead to Doom, Volumes 1 to 4. My Room as a Dungeon Rest Up, Volumes 1 and 2. My Senpai is Annoying, Volume 1. My Status as an Assassin Obviously Exceeds the Heroes, Volume 1 and 2. My Youth Romantic Comedy is Going Wrong as Expected at Comic, Volume 1. And then we have some Naruto, Volumes 1. 32. So here we have the rest of Naruto, so volumes 3 to 72. There's also Naruto and the 7th Akage and the Scarlet Spring, which is sort of a one-off um, between just before Boruto, I think. Also Chibi Sasuke Sharigan Legend, volumes 1 to 3. I don't think that's doing any doing anymore. Um, and the Naruto official complete data book. I have a lot of Naruto stuff in hindsight. So we have the Naruto official fan book and four of the Naruto stories, so Itachi's, Kakashi's, Kuris and Chikamaru's. Um, they are light novels, so I should probably sit them with my light novels, but been on here for so long. Maybe I'll move them. Maybe I won't. Maybe I will. Oh well. Um, volume 1 of uh, Natsume's Book of Friends. Volumes 1 and 2 of New Game. Volumes 1 to 5 of New Sukhoi, False Love. Volumes 1 and 2 of No Game, No Life. Volume 1 of No Matter How It... No Matter... Uh, no Matter How I Look At It, It's You Guys Fault I'm Not Popular. Um, Noragami, Volumes 1 to 22. This is becoming a bit more infrequently published as well, which is quite sad. Um, Monthly Girls, Nozaki-kun, Volume 1, and 1 to 4 of One Piece. So this shelf is actually just more One Piece. Um, originally, when I started reading One Piece, there was only 63 volumes out, or 60 or so. And at the time, there was a bookstore on my way home from school that 
had manga in it and they have they had volumes of One Piece and they were completely sporadic. So I think the first volume of One Piece I ever read was volume 24. Um, and they were all £2 each, which is crazy cheap. So by the time I caught up, I think I had two thirds of the series and I paid £2 a volume. So I spent like £80 for 40 or so volumes. And it was wonderful. Unfortunately, the shops closed down. Otherwise, I would be frequenting there a lot more. Um, I also have volumes one to three of One Piece in French. A friend had bought me these when she was working in France for a little while. She knew nothing about manga, but she knew I really liked One Piece, so she picked them up for me, which I think is wonderful. And I absolutely want to try and collect volume one of One Piece in a whole variety of languages when I'm able to travel again. One day. One day. Um, and I have volumes one and two of Age the Story, which again is actually a light novel and should probably sit with my light novels. And volumes one to 20 of One Punch Man. I'm missing 21. I'm hoping that it's going to arrive for Christmas, but I'll see. I have volumes one and two of Orange, and that's complete, but I think there's a follow-up one, which I don't have. Um, volume one of Our Dreams at Dusk, and volumes one to six of We in High School Host Club. Um, volume one's actually probably one of my worst condition volumes. That was a second-hand one, and I might replace that at some point, but the inside of the volume's completely fine, so I'm a bit loath to, because I don't like waste, but maybe, maybe one day. This row, I have volumes 7 to 18 of Uran, so that's complete. Um, I have volumes 1 to 4 of Overlord, volume 1 of Pandora Hearts, Volumes 1 to 3 of Parallel Paradise. Volume 1 of Perfect World. Volumes 1 to 3 of Persona 5. Volumes 1 to 5 of Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney, and that's complete. That was really hard to find. <laughs> I had Volume 3 for a really long time to try and complete it, and then, of course, couldn't find Volume 2. Something wrong with Volume 2s, and I don't know why but I've managed to complete it and it's wonderful. If you love the game, you'll love the book. Series. Um, Platinum End, Volumes 1 to 11. Prince Freya, Volumes 1 and 2. Prison School, Volume 1. Volumes 1 to 6 are Pokemon Adventures. Um, Pokemon I Choose You, which is, I think, based off the movie. Um, Promise Neverland, Volumes 1 to 17. I think that series is actually complete now. Volume 1 of Queen's Quality. Volumes 1 to 11 of Quintessential Quintuplets. And Volumes 1 and 2 of Ran and the Grey World. Uh, volumes 1 and 2 of Brave Master. Um, I think that's out of print as well. I mean, it's Tokyo Pop. Um, I'm not looking forward to trying to collect the rest of this because I think it's about 30 volumes and they're all hard to find. I really like Fairy Tale and Eden Zero, so I do really want to try and read them. It just might take a while. <laughs> but I, mm, yeah. Um, Reincarnated as a Sword, Volumes 1 to 3. Re Monster, Volumes 1 and 2. Re Zero. Oh, <laughs> the numbering on Re Zero, I really dislike. So I have Chapter 1, Volumes 1 and 2. Chapter 2, Volumes 1 to 5, and Chapter 3, Volumes 1 to 6. Uh, Rent a Girlfriend, Volumes 1 to 4. Rickram of the Rose King, Volume 1. Restaurant to Another World, Volume 1. Rising of Shield Hero, Volumes 1 to 5. Rosario's Vampire, Volumes 1 to 4. Royal Tutor, Volumes 1 and 2. Saga of Tanya the Evil, Volume 1, Sailor Moon, Volumes 1 and 2, and Saint Young Man, Volumes 1 to 4. Um, so we have Saki the Succubus, Hungers Tonight, Volumes 1 and 2, Say I Love You, Volumes 1 to 10, and Volume 17, because it was, of course, on sale. Scarlet, Volume 1, School Rumble, Volumes 1 and 2, 
Seraph of the End, Volumes 1 to 12. Seven Deadly Sins, Volumes 1 to 5. Short Cake Cake, Volumes 1 to 6. And Silent Voice, Volumes 1 to 2. One and two. We have Volumes 1 to 13 of Sleepy Princess and the Demon Castle. Volumes 1 to 9 of Snow White with the Red Hair. Volumes 1 to 3 of So What? So I'm a Spider, So What? Volumes 1 and 2 of Something's Wrong With Us. Volumes 1 and 2 of Soul Eater. Volume 1 of Spice and Wolf. Volumes 1 and 2 of Spy X Family. And Volumes 1, and t 1 to 10 of Strobe Edge. I wasn't going to originally pick Strobe Edge up because I read it was going out of print. And then I was in been on it last week and they had 3 to 10 and I was like oh okay well why not okay <laughs> and then I just grabbed it all um, I'm quite pleased actually because some of the later volumes are actually quite hard to pick up and I really like the artist so I am glad to be able to have all of her works that have been published on my shelves <laughs> um, and so I ordered volumes 1 and 2 and they arrived a couple of days ago which is nice a complete set um, and Sweat and Soap Volumes 1 to 4. Um, so, gosh, there were a lot of Sword Art Online series. So, I have Sword Art Online Aincrad, which is a one shot. Sword Art Online Caliber, which is also a one shot. Volume 1 of Sword Art Online Fairy Dance. Volume 1 of Sword Art Online Girls Ops. Volume 1 of Sword Art Online Mother's Rosary. Volumes 1 to 7 of Sword Art Online Progressive. I did think this was complete, but I read that there was another volume coming out over August, but I haven't seen it yet anywhere. I need to follow up with that. Um, volume 1 of Tales of Wedding Rings. Volumes 1 to 10 of Takane and Hannah. Volumes 1 to 7 of Tagami Baki. Volumes 1 to 3 of That Blue Sky Feeling and Volumes 1 and 2 of That Time I Reincarnated as a Slime So we have Volumes 3 to 14 of That Time I Reincarnated as a Slime That Time I Reincarnated as a Slime, The Ways of the Monster Nation um, I didn't realise at the time how far ahead this story takes place compared to where the manga is at the moment um, So I can't read it yet because I have no idea what's going on which is really annoying, so I'm just going to hold out until the manga catches up so I can read that one. Um, volume 1 of There's a Demon Lord on the Floor. Volume 1 of To Save the World, Can You Wake Up the Morning After with a Demi-Human. Volumes 1 and 2 of To Your Eternity. Volumes 1 to 6 of Toilet Bound Hanukkah-kun. Volumes 1 to 3 of Tokyo Ghoul. Vol um, Volume 1 of Triage X Volumes 1 and 2 of Twin Star Exorcists Volumes 1 and 2 of Vagabond and Volumes 1 to 3 of Vinland Saga and Volumes 1 and 2 of Waiting for Spring So this is the last shelf, goodness me! <laughs> so we have Volume 3 of Waiting for Spring Volumes 1 to 3 of The Water Dragon's Bride Volumes 1 to 4 of The Way of the House Husband. Volumes 1 to 12 of We Never Learn. Volume 1 of We Swore to Meet in the Next Life, and that's when things go weird. Volumes 1 and 2 of Who Says Warriors Can't Be Babes. Volumes 1 to 6 of Witch Hat Atelier. Volume 1 of Woof Woof Story I Told You to Turn Me into a Pampered Pooch, Not Fenrir. Volume 1 of World's End Harem. Volumes 1 to 3 of World's End Harem Fantasia. Volumes 1 and 2 of The World's Strongest Rearguard. Um, something else that I can't read. Uh, Labyrinth, Country, Novice Seeker. Volume 1 of uh, Watakoi, Love is Hard for an Otaku. Volumes 1 and 2 of Yonor of the Dawn. Volume 1 of Your Lie in April. Volumes 1 to 3 of Your Name. Volumes 1 and 2 of Your Name, Another Earthbound, and Volume 1 of Yuna and the Haunted Springs. Hot Springs. Hi, I hope you liked 
my shelf tour. I apologise for rambling and shaky camera. <laughs> um, I'm starting to plan some other videos where I'm going to talk about some series and potentially a haul that I'm going to be getting in the next week or so. Um, so please check it out. Thank you. <laughs> Bye.